Quick video tonight. Guys here made quick work of it today. Got most of the floor structure. Most of the floor structure in place. A couple more things to do. I think before they're trying to wrap up. And it looks like the subfloor will go down tomorrow. I doubt many walls, but this is a good day's work. Um, see a couple of things in here. Got the the eye joists and these double glue lambs kind of heading off heading off for the the stairwell here and these giant beams look at the size of these beams down the middle there they're not gonna move uh, the posts are temporary of course um, they'll get removed once the steel gets in there can't really get in today, uh, but tomorrow hopefully this will all be decked and I'll come down, take you for a tour of the basement as it will look when all is said and done. Well, they're about to get this last, the very last floor joist in on the first floor here. There was uh, a lot more lumber piled up around the side here this morning when I came, and it's all gone. They used it all, so that's pretty impressive. Um, you can see all of the, this is the barrier that we're gonna be using in the basement. And it goes all the way to the other side. So down here, it'll get tied in to the basement walls. And out here, it'll get pulled up and tie it into uh, the blue skin on the outside. And in this space, ooh, it's a good looking spider right there. Interesting. But this is where uh, the brick gets laid. It'll be sheathing and some insulation, and then the four inches of brick. And all of that is taped off. It's airtight. I'm trying to get as tight as possible. Again, look at the size of these. Beam, the beam under there is substantial. It's got to be, I don't know, 16 inches? I thought it was going to be 12 or 14 maybe, but this is more than that. These joists are 12 inches. And so that has got to be 16 or 18. Um, so, no joke. These little bits all get put in between more joists to kind of tighten them up every so often. He's cutting up now. Some more of those, and uh, we'll see where they all land today. So he's straightening it out. This is a cool technique. He's using the string line to gauge how straight everything is, and then they uh, they got hangers and things that'll secure it in place when that's all done. So yeah, pretty cool. Tomorrow. Subfloor gets glued and screwed, glued and nailed. There's the glue and nails for the subfloor. And uh, we're doing wait for the saw there. We're doing seven eighths subfloor, so it'll be a little thicker because these are two feet on center instead of your typical sixteen. So yeah, exciting stuff. Should be a busy week and lots of production. All right, I'll leave it there. It's kind of noisy. Take care.